Hello guys, how are you going? A little video here to demonstrate uh, what sort of space you could possibly put a coaling stage into. Now, the piece of track here going up the gradient is a piece of uh, standard Pico Code 100 flex track raising up 42mm high on that piece of timber there parked up behind the Black 5. Now, down the other end here I've got the uh, little Hornby Pug and three 16 tonne mineral wagons will demonstrate how easy it is for this little logo to push these wagons up such a so short slope. Here we go. And up to the top. You can imagine the uh, coaling stage will be sitting there where the uh, wagons have stopped, being unloaded, and run back down again. Not too fast, don't want to run out of track. Just to get an idea of the uh, actual gradient here, I'll come back here a little bit down behind the, uh, the Black 5 just to give an idea and we'll run the loco and train back up again. Pushes up with gentle ease, no problem at all. Pull her up, once again, take her down. You can imagine the, uh, the blank space here would be filled in with a little bit of landscape and what have you, you know, a retaining wall, so there you go. Just shows you what sort of space you could possibly fit a, uh, a coaling stage into. I do understand that most coaling stages are 42mm high, they're probably a little bit higher, but it just demonstrates that uh, with a bit of thought, a little bit of space, maybe spare space on the layout, a coaling stage could be positioned in here quite nicely. Cheers!